Turkey is at crossroads. The fate of the country will be decided in a double election for the presidency and the parliament on Sunday. The battle is for the future path of democracy. President Erdogan, who is running for the new term, argues that the current political system is not efficient enough to give the country the leadership it needs. The checks and balances provided by the parliament and the judiciary create division and weaken the country, his supporters argue. However, his opponents say the independence of these institutions is essential to prevent one leader from wielding too much power. To settle the question, Erdogan asked his supporters to back his vision in 2017 and won a referendum by the narrowest of margins. Now, all opposition vows to reverse those constitutional reforms and strengthen the parliament. Therefore, the Turkish society is extremely polarized. If Erdogan wins, he and any other future president will have the authority to rule through executive orders, have full budgetary powers, retain the political leadership of the party and handpick MPs, the authority to appoint members to judges and prosecutors council and even unilaterally call for a double election just like the one on Sunday. The Turkish people will have their say, although polls indicate that the presidential election will go on a second round. Now, no matter what happens, you will first find out on Euronews.